You may say to me, you aren't ready to live for Jesus Christ now. Like, do you know when you are going to die? Do you know what is going to happen to you in the next minute or so? If Jesus Christ came down to earth and asked you, are you willing to try to live for him now? You would probably definitely say yes. So if you would say yes, then why not say yes now? Like, what else? Think about this life. I believe the meaning to this life is to live for Jesus Christ. Like, if you take that out of the equation, like, isn't life empty? Like, how many times... If living for Jesus Christ is not our purpose, isn't life empty? Some people may say they live for getting drunk, or they live to fornicate, or they live to this, for this or that. If that is so, isn't life empty? Isn't it? You may believe you have so much time. You may believe you are going to live until you are 60, 70, or whatever. But some people don't live so long on this earth. So why would you believe you are so fortunate? Hmm? You may want to do this evil thing. You, want, you may want to do that evil thing, this or that. But is it truly worth your eternity. I know when I was younger, um, I forget what age I was, a pastor asked me if I am ready to give my life to God, get saved or something like that. And ultimately, I told him no. What if I would have died that second? Like, dropped dead that second. I would be in hell now, I assume. But God has been so merciful to me back then and still now. Don't take, how can I say this? Don't take chances with your eternity. You are either going to be in hell or heaven, right? Listen, living for Jesus Christ may be, I guess, somewhat difficult but isn't it wise or to your advantage to go through it and reach heaven afterward i think so so let's do the right thing let me stop here god bless you